Inside this nondescript building in northeast Philadelphia, and we have lift off. students are learning about outer space by conducting simulated missions. The hands-on program, called SPARK, was recently grounded due to budget problems. But thanks to the school's alumni, who raised thousands of dollars, it's now been relaunched. It means so much to us that so many alumni and so many community members realize the importance of this program. There was a lot of bumps in the road to get to where we are today, and I'm just really happy that we could be here right now. Spark began more than 50 years ago. Not long after the space race heated up between the U.S. and the Soviet Union, it was the first NASA-recognized high school space program in the country. Students work with a 21-foot-long shuttle simulator and an actual Apollo mission training capsule. It means so much to the students. They put so much into it. They are um, investigating space, science, uh, robotics, engineering. Each year, they design a two-day virtual voyage into space. And this year, they're trying to colonize the moon. Supporters hope they'll be able to modernize outdated equipment and keep students interested in science. Ned Barker, Associated Press.